Hey guys, Frendush here. In this video today, we will repeat the process from the last video, but it's a different item. You see that in my hand is a, a silver plated copper wire. I do not bother with the yield and the amount of uh, material and the amount of uh, silver which I get on the end uh, because it's never the same. But here we can do some yield because this is the material who mostly have a similar amount of the plating. Okay, so let's see. 174 gram uh, silver plated copper wire. So right now I will add this to the beaker and uh, I add some dilute, very dilute nitric acid, okay? guys so this is after process is finished this is what I left from my silver plated wire see that no more silver on this wire only a copper and uh, right now I start the filter solution and uh, if you see that on the bottom it's actually some dirty silver slug copper and silver on the bottom Right now I will filter that and uh, I clean that with the fresh nitric acid, then I will start to melt, okay? Okay guys, so after we finish our job, I melt our silver and look at that. Very very nice. I got some pimp here. I don't know why But very very nice purity and let's see What amount of silver we have Okay 
Well, 6.5 gram silver from 117 gram of wire. So, basically not bad because if this stuff is gold, this will be just amazing. But because it's silver, it's just cheap and uh, definitely I hope that silver someday will worth much more but I'm not I'm not sure so once again 6.5 grams silver from 170 gram of silver plated jewelry wire okay hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit that bell button and uh, I will see you in the next video. Cheers, friend Ushnaut.